What's up guys, this is Chronic Rush HD and welcome back to episode 23 of my FIFA 13 Road to Gold Around the World series. And we're going to start straight into a game and as you can see there in the um, time uh, counter that is already gone past half time. And before I um, really get into the content of this episode, I would just like to apologise that halfway through my recording I've done two games, I'd already played two games. I've got the results for them um, later on the video as evidence. And um, we played two games, started playing this game, and uh, then my Elgato seemed to want to, uh, um, what's it called, the dis disconnect from my computer, and the software crashed, and once that happens, you can't, um, I couldn't stop the recording, so uh, it like processed the uh, video, and um, I just had to quickly restart it and try and get as much footage as I possibly can, and this is where I started. So... As you can see, we're playing this game, and um, we're already 1-0 up in the 51st minute. We've already played two games, and I've got evidence of those in the end of the episode. Uh, so, uh, you, you kind of haven't missed anything. You've probably only missed goals, and that's it. And also, from um, we've also had quite a few players sell from our SPL. So, we've got quite a big um, to coin total now, uh, plus this team. This team seems to be doing pretty well, but as you can see there... Um, Gudiere, I'm not quite sure how you pronounce that, but he scored a goal in the 54th minute to make it 2-0. And um, I can't remember the uh, other results off the top of my head. But um, we seem to be uh, getting a bit better, playing a bit better, and um, getting a bit more used to this formation. Uh, because I've kind of been away from it a bit. But the team we came against was um, a uh, kind of an English, um, an English mix hybrid team. It's got uh, the likes of Walcott. Um, Oxlade Chamberlain, uh, you got some uh, uh, Premier League players and um, uh, you got some uh, Brazilians as well. So it wasn't a good, it wasn't a, a bad team. I believe he had some um, uh, chemistry issues. But as you can see, he got two corners in a row. And, uh, uh, sorry, yeah, yeah, two no, yeah, two corners in the row. And he does this uh, special uh, corner taking and um, my keeper's going to catch that out. And I, I was quite afraid when I saw that because I always seem to do really, really bad against those. I don't know. I just can't defend them. But um, I lose the ball out. Oxlade Chamberlain's going to pick this up. Uh, goes through on goal. And he's going to put that into the bottom left-hand corner to make it 2-1 in the 59th minute. And um, this game is pretty even throughout the uh, whole game, I believe. Um, both at each other then having a decent amount of shots at each other. But uh, straight from kickoff, we do a quick run. Uh, through ball over to Mears, the right back, who as you can see there, he's got quite a bit of pace, and he's only got like 78 pace on the game, um, but overall he's not a bad uh, right back whatsoever, I definitely recommend trying him, <coughs> but he gets a goal kick, and we're going to head of that back to our centre mid, and um, I've actually got the uh, whole game, as you can see, it's counting down, so this bit, I haven't um, cut this bit out at all, uh, and um, I just thought it'd give me it was going to be a really really short episode if I did I wanted to uh, kind of sustain the uh, 10 plus minute um, videos uh, but um I thought it'd give also give me some time to talk to you about stuff any ideas and the likes of that so um uh, regarding this series next obviously the next league we've got is going to be the Barclays Premier League team and um, I'm gonna ask you guys do you want me to go straight on to the likes of do, making a team out of bronze players Moving up to some of the silvers and then obviously up to the gold. Or should we just go and try and build the best team we can with the amount of coins we have? I'm currently looking to see actually how many bronze players there are. There's quite a few but they don't seem to be available in the game. I'm not quite sure why. Maybe they just haven't added them. They did recently add the likes of um, uh, Lucas Piazon who I know has transferred. Annie Obi, Sammy Annie Obi and the likes of that. So we've got a, a fair few more but... Uh, Still, I could make a team out of uh, the uh, bronze players. I'm looking at them now, and there seem to be uh, quite a few, but the only trouble is the fact that I'm looking on foothead and that some of these players aren't actually in the game. So um, it's going to be extremely hard to make a team. So I need to see I need to see how many players are actually on the market. And then so I can definitely do a silver team, guys, if you want me to do that, see how it goes. And um, then obviously I will be able to do a gold team. And then regarding on to what leagues should I move on to next, what nationality. So um, we're going to go uh, to the right, so to Europe and then to the uh, uh, Africa and all the stuff like that, all the countries that side, and then finish off at American leagues and all the likes of that. So the whole bulk of um, FIFA is basically Europe, so that's why I'm going the Europe side first. So uh, 
we got um, good uh, content the whole way through. But um, I'm not sure what countries to go through because um, obviously being in the United Kingdom, you've got quite a few countries in an equal distance in a sense to you. Uh, so you've got the France is obviously let's say the mo the closest um, country shall I say to us. So it'd probably be the most obvious to go to. So I think I may go to the French league. And uh, I've got a map up now, so I can have a quick look. So, obviously, the Fran France is probably the closest, but then Germany's, uh, Belgium's pretty close as well, and all that side. So, we could go... Um, I'm just trying to think of this, how we could go. Guys, I would like your impact as well. Uh, but we could go to the likes of... Um, I was thinking... The f I was thinking, if I went to France, then I'd want to go and do the Portugal side and all down there. So, I might go, um, say, I'll do the United Kingdom... Finish that off, Barclays Premier League. Move down to the French League, do bronze, silver, uh, League one, League two, and League one. And then I'll move down to the likes of Spain, do the Spanish League, do the Portuguese League. That'd be very, very interesting. And then move back up, do the Belgium, Netherlands, um, some of the uh, Scandinavian leagues. I'm not quite sure of them off the top of my head. And then go back down to Germany. Maybe do um, go down to Italy. And kind of make my way across, um, like up and down, up and down, up and down, um, in a kind of way that I would cover everything in a kind of um, systematic way, shall I say. So uh, it's not getting too confusing. But um, I will also be doing... Guys, tell me if you liked... If you haven't watched my first episode, go and watch it. I did kind of like a special intro thing. And uh, I'd like to have your guys' impact on it, see what you thought of it. Maybe I could do it for the other leagues. I think it may be a bit harder, though. But as you can see here, in the diamonds of the game, he makes it to all with the Ox in the 87th minute. A very, very annoying goal. Um, we seem to be cut loose at the back, and he just seemed to capitalise on it very, very well. I thought I'd cleared it out when I headed it, but I headed it straight to his player. Just left him through on goal, and um, basically... Uh, it got me kind of frustrated, but back on to the uh, series and all the stuff like this. This game's coming to an end, so um, we will get the final result in a bit. Uh, but then I'll move on, and then I'll move on to um, do all the leagues, European leagues, shall I say, and move on to the uh, Russian league, I think that might be close. I'm not sure of the uh, African leagues. I'm not sure how many of them are there. I think it may just be the likes of uh, the South African league, I think that is. Uh, maybe go down and do them. I'll probably do that before I do Russia, just because that's closer to uh, the United Kingdom and stuff like that. And then move all the way to the Japanese League. Um, is there any more? Korean League and that lot. Move it down to the uh, Australian League and then uh, all the way back over to America. Do the American Leagues and um, then we've done ba basically. And then I'll <clears throat> I'm not quite sure how long this is going to take. It seems like a really, really good idea. really uni unique series idea and... Um, uh, it just seems to be going for quite a long time, the amount of episodes, I'm currently on the, uh, this is the 23rd episode, which doesn't seem a lot, but it does take quite a lot to make these episodes, if you think about it, especially on those uh, games where I lose 10-0 or win 10-0, and um, because you've just got to edit all the clips, get shorten it all down, make it uh, commentate over it, and it seems to take a good long time to do it, but the game finally finishes at 2 all. Uh, so we got a point, and I believe that's the first point, well, we have to have a look at the um, uh, two games we played before, but that is another point in this division. We seem to be getting a bit better. This team feels solid. I just don't seem to be playing as well. But the I've got here that I managed to get the uh, first goal of the game, as you can see there. So you haven't missed anything other than two games, previous games. And um, <coughs> we'll bring up the match details. As you can see, it's a pretty even game. I did have more shots than him, so I thought I should have won that game. He just seemed to have the more pacey team, obviously. And there, you probably could tell that I've already... Um, uh, we got we bring them up the uh, what's it called the uh, results there, but as you can see there we lost one game and drew one game, so we got two points in total now, and um, as you can see there we are uh, getting our coins back up after buying the team. Most of our players are selling, Mo a good chunk of them sold before the episode. I showed them, but then obviously I lost the fi footage, so um, you kind of didn't see that. But um, I do apologise for that footage. But as you can see here, we're not doing that well in Division Two. Um, I would like to be doing better, but I think later on in this uh, series, we're going to get a bit better. But as you can see, I've got evidence of the FC Farm...